off normal fuel tank. Here we have a majestic lift off of LBM-3M4 rocket carrying India's prestigious Chandrayaan-3 spacecraft. India's celestial 20 minutes of terror. India will go through a nail-biting 20 minutes of terror or a T20 finish. Lift off normal fever tracking. After a majestic lift off, ISRO's Bahubali rocket put Chandrayaan 3 in the Earth's orbit. 200 stages are separated. Chandrayaan 3 took many rounds of the Earth gaining velocity. On August 1st, 2023, Chandrayaan was nudged towards the moon on its 3.84 lakh kilometer lonely journey. On August 5th, 2023, the Chandrayaan satellite gently entered into the moon's orbit and settled in its embrace. In a crucial maneuver, the propulsion module and the Vikram lander with the Pragyan rover separated on August 17, 2023, when the satellite was in a 153 km by 163 km orbit. Soon, the Vikram lander is brought closer to the moon's surface in an elliptical orbit before the power descent can begin. On the day of the landing, the 20 minutes of terror or the T20 kick in for a nail biting finish. In the power descent, the Vikram starts hurtling down towards the moon surface at a velocity of 1.68 kilometers per second, which is nearly 6048 kilometers per hour, almost 10 times the velocity of an airplane. Vikram is now slowing down with all four engines firing, but the lander is still almost horizontal to the surface of the moon. It then touches down on the lunar surface with just two engines firing, and the legs have been designed to take a maximum impact of three meters per second or about 10.8 kilometers per hour. Once the sensors on the legs feel the surface, the engines are shut down and the 20 minutes of terror are over. India's flag reaches the moon surface. Subsequently, the ramp opens up the Pragyan rover is rolled down. Once the Pragyan rover reaches the lunar surface, the rover is then free to move around the moon. The big moment arrives when the Vikram lander takes images of the rover and the Pragyan rover takes images of the lander. The first selfies by India from the lunar surface are then beamed back to India. Now, the real science can begin. The Vikram lander and the rover are both solar powered and are made to last one lunar day, which translates to 14 Earth days. In New Delhi, Pallav Bagla for NDTV.